What's going on guys? Welcome back to 4 Misery Gaming for some more Illume content and we had our sneak peek of the Black Friday free to play side only uh, Black Friday sales that we did yesterday so if you guys did not check that out make sure you guys go check that video out but we are going to be going over those prices real fast as well as the actual cash packages for Black Friday as well so we're going to go over everything today um we're not going to spend a lot of time talking about the free to play because we did a whole video on that but these are the prices you guys can see here for the certain things and like i said i thought the prices were very fair for the whole free to play thing um you guys will see here you know pretty good value i would say overall uh like the class seeds you can get for 150,000 gold pretty awesome and you can always get gold uh, 20 rubies is 80,000 gold there. I think that even for rubies, maybe that's worth it. I don't know. That That's one of your dailies is basically giving you 80k gold. Um, and once again, premium gotcha ticket, very, very good value. 100 rubies for a summon, uh, for a tenfold summon. Very, very good. Uh, so, but yeah, you guys can see all these prices here. So they are all live in this post. I will link the posts here as well. Um, and then it looks like it's going to be 50 rubies for the weapon pans for the light shirt gear, which I think that's still worth it overall. 100 rubies for a legendary skill book, probably worth it um, overall. Uh, 100,000 gold for an epic gear summon, um, and then a legendary gear summon is going to be 200 rubies. Pretty, pretty worth. So I recommend getting a lot of these. Like I said, probably the probably my same after seeing the prices, the same as um, before. So, you know, but take it as you will at your discretion for the free to play. But let's go into the juice. So first of all, they actually did release this. So these were the some of the original costumes. Um, we have the three three of the summer costumes. Uh, so we have all of them but Baldur. So we have Reve, Freya, and Mika. If you want any of those, you guys can pick those up. They are 500 rubies. And then the fall Fahrenheit costume as well. For 500 rubies so if you guys care about costumes you know me i don't care about costumes and cosmetics so not for me i'll keep my rubies but you guys that do care about your looks um in the game you guys can go ahead and pick that up that is free to play by the way so they were once paid now they are free to play so pretty cool so next we are going to be having the black friday packages so we have the tgif friday package which are all limited to one account so we have the 999 is going to get you 100 rubies, 100,000 gold, 500 aeons, 10 ledger keys, and 5 premium ticket summons. Uh, the number 2 is going to be $100 for 1,000 rubies, 300,000 gold, 250k alune lights, 42,000 seeds, 75 altar stones, and then 30 premium summons. Then we have the gear package, 1,000 rubies. Then we're going to have six lightature weapon and armor summon tickets. Now, I'm pretty sure what this means is you're going to actually get those tickets. I don't think you're going to actually then have to craft because it's not a pan. So you should get a random lightature weapon and armor gear. I'm hoping the rates are higher for necklaces and for, um, for necklaces and for the uh, boots. Or at least as long as you get at least two of them, like I'd be content. And then you're going to get uh, six epic to legendary exclusive gear summons. That's a lot. Six of them. That's pretty good. I would assume the rate for legendary is probably low, though. Uh, then you get uh, 150 random sealed lightsher soul tickets. Uh, I think that means that you're those are the soul gems. I would assume it's a mix between common and uncommons, which is the 80 and 85. And then 1,000 light and hand stone. So from these three packages... I think hands down number three is probably the only one I would get. And the reason why is for the, you're getting a thousand rubies um, for the same price as the package two, which is double the price. So the ruby value is insanely more, obviously. Um, so a thousand rubies for 50 bucks ain't bad. Plus the other stuff you're getting, you're getting a thousand, the light and hand stones, which is super so they are super rare in the game. They are very, very rare in the game. So that's very, very good value. Um, and then the chance of you still getting... I think you'll probably get at least one legendary gear summon off that. Um, and then the lighter weapon armor. If you get at least two, I feel, of boots 
or necklaces, that's going to be very, very good value because Ascaria and um, and Ima are the two of the hardest bosses to beat in the game right now. So to complete a set, I think it's totally worth it. So those are the main value that I feel. So, you know, the chance of you getting an epic or legendary, um, very good exclusive gear, and then if it happens to have good main stats, then you may want to roll it. So uh, I think this pack is good value. I think $100 for the other value is just so, like, I don't feel the values there. I don't feel a 1,000 rubies is worth $100 plus, you know, a Loon Lights and Loon Seeds. Yeah, it's a lot, but technically they are free to play. So with the amount of Aeons we are getting in the game, I don't feel you need to spend the money for that, to be honest. And $10 for 100 rubies for basically 10 class seeds is like the main value here, getting 10 class seeds. 500 Aeons is okay, but we're not starving on Aeons, so you don't need to be spending actual cash for Aeons. And five premium tickets, I mean, a day you guys get guaranteed three premium tickets. So I don't feel one and two are good. I, I feel three is good, though. I feel that's probably the one I'm going to pick up. Um, I had a sale on iTunes gift cards at Costco, so I basically got um, $100 worth of iTunes for uh, 80 bucks. So I'll probably pick that up. So let's go into Friday and then, or do we only have three? Uh, I guess so, okay. So I guess there was only the those packages. Okay, I thought this was actual packages when I saw this thumbnail, but it, it's not. All right, so those are the three, thank goodness it's Friday packages. And then now we have the Black Friday, the Friday Ruby packages. So these are all actually pretty good. So. If you have the cash, if you're limited on 60 bucks, I would say, this is pretty good value overall. Um, so you look at it here, a uh, dollar is gonna get you 100 rubies. So pretty, pretty good value there. Um, and then keep in mind, you are getting the other gems too. Do we get the gems here? Okay, we do, yeah. So which, which should be dollar for dollar. So every, every dollar should be one of these crystals. So keep in mind, you guys do get the paid crystals as well. So. Like I said, the even though you don't see the image here, you should be getting 50 of the paid crystals for the $50 pack. Um, so dollar for 100 gems, good value, can't go wrong there. Um, then the the Friday 2 pack is gonna get you, what is that, 1,000 rubies for 30 bucks? That seems pretty good. Um, I'd have to go back in game and actually check the level up packs to see what the ruby to ratio is there. So I may, um, I may converse that before I go ahead and buy any of these, but I'll probably definitely get the dollar pack just because why not? Um, $30 for a thousand rubies seems pretty darn good. And then an extra 20 bucks is going to net you an extra 500 rubies. So overall, generally you look at, um, overall I think it's like something like uh, every $10 is worth like, 100 rubies generally um so overall this seems good that's 1500 rubies for 50 bucks so that means you are for the for the big pack that means value wise you're basically getting what is that uh 200 isn't that like hang on let me do math I'm, i don't want to give you guys misinformation uh, so we have 1,500 rubies, or yeah, 1,500 rubies divided by 50. So that's every dollar is basically getting you 30 rubies. So that's pretty good. Obviously not as good as package four, where a dollar is getting you 100 rubies. But every dollar is getting you 30 rubies. So that's pretty darn good overall, I would say. So I think they're probably worth it. Um, these ones here are pretty good. Um... I, but I do feel the value in the $50 pack still is better. Um, even though you're missing out on 500 rubies, I still feel the chance of you getting a legendary, a legendary, um, a legendary exclusive gear or getting one of the key pieces you need to complete a 80 or 85 lighter set or the just the 1,000 enhanced stones because they're such a rare item is super good value. So. Me personally, I'm for sure probably going to be getting the gear pack, and then I'm probably going to be getting the one dollar pack at least. Um, I'll have to see. I'm gonna I'm converse or not converse, but I'm going to compare the level up packs to see because I actually don't need rubies too terribly bad right now. So um, 
I'll have to see how the level up packs stack up to these. If these are so much better in value than the level up packs, then I may get them. Uh, but because uh, that is overall, then I'd be looking at 130 bucks to spend. And I just did. I did spend about 70 bucks on packs from the Summoner's War packs. So I'll have to see what I want to do. But that is going to be the Black Friday paid packs, as well as we did go over the free to play packs as well, guys. So. Let me know what you guys think of them overall. Are you guys going to buy them? Are you guys thinking of dropping a little bit of cash uh, for Black Friday on a loon? Let me know all that, guys. Or if you guys are going to go free to play only, let me know which of these packs you guys are going to get with your gold and your rubies. Uh, like I said, you get, I gave you my thoughts in the last video of what to go for, which was basically any of the exclusive gears. The uh, the boots, the lighter uh, sets are probably pretty good to get, and then the class seeds for sure. So, and the light shirt temple keys as well. So those are the things to look out for. Let me know what you guys think over on the comment section down below. I appreciate you guys checking out the channel on Thanksgiving today. Hope you guys all have an awesome holiday. Make sure you guys spend some time with your families, eat some turkey for your boy Fort. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure you guys hit the subscribe button down below. We are growing so fast with all the, in the last 24 to 48 hours. So I appreciate you guys, all you new subscribers for your continued support. If you guys did enjoy today's content, make sure you guys like today's video, share the video, all that good stuff, and click the bell for notifications so you guys do not miss the next upload. Thank you guys so much. Have an awesome Thanksgiving, and I will see you guys in the next one. Later, guys.